Kia ora Hello, everybody. My name is Tamsin. Uh, you might know me by my editor name, Dr. Thneed, and I am a Wikidata and Wikipedia editor in Dunedin in New Zealand, where it is currently spring. And I'm excited to talk to you today about the Web2Sit tool, which is a tool for collaborative citations on Wikipedia. Let me show you how it works. So let's say I want to cite this news article about our prime minister on Wikipedia. I would copy the URL, go to Wikipedia, and paste that into the Cytoid tool to create my citation. And you'll see that Cytoid is going to suggest something that isn't quite perfect. Um, here is the Cytoid suggestion, and it wants to use the website template for this news article. Now, I would prefer it use the news article template. So I could fix that manually myself for this citation, but then I'll need to fix it for every citation individually from the spin-off or of this article. Um, what the Web2Sit tool allows is for one technically competent editor to fix that for everybody. So you can see below here, the Web2Sit suggestion is using the news article template because one editor has gone in and said, every article on this particular domain is likely to be a news article, please use the news article template. And so Web2Sit will always suggest that now. And if Cytoid wasn't picking up the title or it wasn't picking up the author, you would also be able to tell it where to find that information. And it will fix it for every article from that domain for every Web2Sit user. And that's what I think makes this such a cool tool. The other thing that makes it a cool tool is it has great documentation. So here is the meta page for Web2Sit. Uh, it shows you at the top here uh, the code that you can paste into your common JS if you want to be a Web2Sit user and just benefit from these improved citations. But further down, if you want to be one of those people who fixes citations for other people, there are some great resources, including video explainers, recordings of workshops, um, documentation in English and Spanish, because this is a multilingual tool. So thank you very much to the developer, Diego de la Herra, and his team, and congratulations on the award. <laughs>